Hey y'all, Irix guy here and I was riding my bike and I was thinking about drone etiquette. And that's something that a lot of people, you know, you may have pondered and not realized really what you were what you were thinking about. But anytime any new thing comes into existence in society, you know, there's going to be uh there's going to be rules. And not just regulation. Cuz we know there's a lot of proposed regulation surrounding drones. But there's also the etiquette piece. So what do I mean by drone etiquette? Well, there's a lot of people, they call them drones. A lot of people call them quadcopters. A lot of people call them multi-rotors, UAVs, UASs. Some people say the full thing, unmanned aerial vehicle or um, unmanned aerial system. And, and the list goes on. But the thing is... This is where the etiquette comes into play because I don't know if it's appropriate to call a drone a drone. And I use the word drone because when you search, when when most people search for a video, that's likely the term that they're likely going to associate with that video. You know, hey, let's go watch a drone video on YouTube. You know, and maybe one of Irix Guy's Adventure Channel videos comes up. YouTube.com forward slash Irix Guy, the channel you're watching right now. But your average Jane or your average Joe is probably not going to search for UAS or UAV or multi-rotor or quadcopter. You know, there's there's a there's a um and and I don't like the word drone either because it's the it's something that a lot of the media are responsible for pinning a negative uh connotation to that word drone. So I don't like it from that perspective, but then again, if it wasn't for the media, people would likely not even know that drones exist, that these aerial videos exist, these aerial photos are out there for recreational entertainment. People would probably not know that. So it's kind of a double-edged sword. So I think that in my mind, when it comes to drone etiquette, I don't really feel that calling a drone a drone is a bad thing, but I think that calling a drone a drone may be frowned upon by the camp of people that are in the know with drones which I feel I'm in the know with drones. I mean, I've been playing with them since Phantom 1. Had two Phantom 2 Vision Pluses because I crashed one into a tree. It was my own fault. It was not Phantom 2 Vision Plus failure, and it was obviously in a safe location. And then I've had the Irix Guy 4K Phantom 2. And now, on pre-order, the DJI Phantom 3 Professional on pre-order from snagbear.com. So if you haven't ordered your uh, Phantom 3 yet, Excuse me. You can, you can go ahead and pre-order the Phantom 3 from snagbear.com. And I'll be sure to post the case, the batteries, other accessories there as soon as I get my hands on them. Because I want to make sure that everything is out there. But I don't know. What do you all think about etiquette? Because, you know, a lot of people, a lot of people seem to be offended by the word drone when you're referring to drone videos. But from my perspective, doing things to the best of my abilities to, to engage the viewers, to attract new viewers, and to encourage people to share, if I call it a UAS or a UAV, only the, the hardcore drone people are probably going to know what that is. You know, it's not going to be your Jane or your Joe that's searching, hey, I saw one of those things flying over. What was that? Well, that was a drone. We'll go on YouTube and search for drones. But those same people wouldn't be like, Hey, I saw this thing flying over. What was that? Why, that was an unmanned aerial system. And maybe there are some people that would say that. But I guess where I'm going with this is that I think that the media are responsible for giving drones a bad name. I agree. But I think that it's still necessary to use that term to be most effective with, 
with uh, attracting a large audience of viewers for, for drone videos. Do I think it's unethical? I don't think it's unethical, but I think it's probably frowned upon by people that are, uh, that are serious drone users. And I'm a serious drone user, but I still use the word because honestly, I don't really care. I do care. I mean, obviously I care. I care what people think, but I don't let, I, I, I'm not one to create conflict out of things that there shouldn't be conflict surrounding. I mean, why, you know, if, if you want to call it, if you want to say data and I want to say data, you know, don't criticize me for saying data and I won't criticize you for saying data. It's just a word. You know, words are words. And uh, actions speak louder than words. So if you've got a drone, a UAV, a UAS, a multi-rotor, a quadcopter, a hexacopter, whatever you want to call it, it's the videos and the photos that speak, whatever you call that thing. And maybe we come up with a new term. Maybe it's not any of those. Maybe it's called a, uh, just call it an IRIX guy. You know, search for IRIX guy. And that, that's the new term for drone. Who knows? But anyway, tell me what you think. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash IRIXGuy. Now share this video with others. Be sure to visit IRIXGuy.com. Sign up for my newsletter. It's, uh, I've had two, I've put out two, two, two newsletters so far, and I think it's pretty good. But sign up and tell me what you think. And share this video and any of my videos with others. Thanks for watching, and y'all have a good day.